first. I'm a Java developer. Mm -hmm. I have been for, oh, I don't know, over 15 years anyway. And Duchess is a network for female Java developers and other women who are interested in Java, who are not might not be developers, but who have some interest. Um, it's, it's just to give us a little support network in this man's world. And we ve always uh, urge our members to also become members of the local jugs, to be active in the community. So what we're doing is we're trying to get more women to be visible in the community at, at large. Yeah, so um, at an event, for example, like DevOx, what, what are some of the things that you do? Uh, at DevOx, we, uh, for, for instance, uh, organize a buff normally. Yep. But as this is our 10th anniversary, we organized yes. a lunch, which was really uh, good fun. We invited uh, several women that we that are here attending. And some about of 30, right? About, about 30, 30 people, something like that. that. Yeah. Okay. And uh, some heard about us. Some just met us here. Uh, so that was uh, very nice to meet new people. Uh, so that's what we do here, and uh, we uh, also encourage people to become speakers. Yeah. Uh, we tell them you can become a speaker. You can start with uh, your local jug, and we uh, and then uh, submit a talk. And we also invite speakers to join us in our bus session to just feel what it is like to be a speaker at a conference. So what? A, how do you start to be uh, as a speaker? Like what kind of sessions you can uh, you can do and you can do. Anything you can do, you can start out with a non-technical session if that feels easier. You can st start with a technical session about something that you're really passionate about, some cool framework or tool that you've just found. Um, you can do a lightning, quickies. a quickies, a right, quickies lightning. like 15 minute talk, or you can go for a conference talk, which is an hour if you have a little bit more to tell. If you're adventurous, you can even go for the full deep dive three hour session. Right. Um, or be even like a co-speaker, right? Or I mean, a you guys, yes. yeah. Yeah. you guys were also co-speakers, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Th that's what we, why we inv uh, invite people to become co-speakers. Mm -hmm. uh, and yeah, it depends on what you want to do. Uh, there's always a big request for uh, how to start at certain points because right. that's not only the deep dives and the things that people really uh, advanced talks. Some people always want to know how do I get started with this particular framework or this particular subject. So how do you come up with subject? Because I know that once you did a topic on um, a spreadsheets or something, you had a quick yeah. a couple of years um, ago. Like give, that, give that an example. So that, example. that was a uh, framework I found because I had a client. The client wanted to have spreadsheets and word documents and. Basically, the project lead said, yeah, we can give you comma-separated value files and we can give you text documents. And I'm like, but that's not what the client is looking for. There must be some framework out there that can do this. And I had some time on my hands because I wasn't working full-time for that client and didn't have another project. So I searched and I actually found the framework and I had some time to play around with it. And I'm like, this is such a cool framework. And nobody I knew in my company had heard of it. So I'm like, right. there must be more people who have never heard of this. So this is a very interesting subject to quickly give an introduction into so people have heard of it and can start using it because right. it was relatively easy to get into anyway. So I was like, I can just do a quickie to show them what it's like and then they can find out the rest for themselves. Right, so finding like a problem at work and that, um, yeah. and it's about sharing knowledge really. It right. is. Yeah, yeah. yeah and uh, one of the subjects we, uh, we did several talks about is uh, teaching kids how to code. So right. that's uh, joined in with the DevOps for Kids uh, team. Because that's that's what you do as well, right? That's something we, uh, right? we do uh, as well. Uh, if we want to have more women in IT, we have to start young. True. <laughs> yeah, because uh, yeah, the <laughs> retention, the, the, the kids, uh, the girls at like 12, 13 years old are like, nah, coding is for, for boys and it's not for, for girls. Why, I don't know, but somehow they... Uh, well, and it's also that a lot of uh, their girlfriends actually go into something else, a different yeah. so then they yeah. tend to do the same as well. So, yeah, so the, we do that and we uh, go to conferences to promote it. Mm -hmm. Also other conferences than DevOx because uh, people don't know about DevOx for kids because right. it's so close to the brand. So that's, uh, and that we do that talk some, uh, and then uh, we rotate the speakers. So uh, one of us does the talk and we take a co-speaker that hasn't done it talks before. 
and then uh, they end up doing a co-presentation somewhere else together. So that was really uh, good fun. Cool. So uh, some of the so what do you do otherwise if you're not at conferences? Do you have a website or is there uh, yeah, anything? Yeah, we, we do have a, a website, uh, jdushes.org, mm -hmm. and the J is there for the Java, of course. And um, Dushes being a royal title is really hard to have a, a website about, so we we get uh, the J in front of our name. And you have also like subgroups, right? How does it work? So it's oh, yeah. a global uh, community, it, but yeah, it's, um, a, it's a global community, and we uh, we encourage everybody to start their own local chapter. Okay. So we have a big chapter in in Sweden and in France, and they are totally autonomous from us. We even don't know how many members they have. We just ask them to tell us uh, their information. Like, do they have a website? Do they have a meetup group? Uh, do they have a, a Twitter handle? so that people can find them. We put, post them on our uh, main website, mm -hmm. and then people can find if there's a local chapter for them and uh, what is the information about that. Right. Actually, the reason that I let all the chapters go on their own was like, I don't know what they need out there. Every country is different. They all sure. have different cultures. I can't make up the rules for everybody because then it will be just my thing, and it's not supposed to be my right. thing. It's, it's supposed to be to help all women out there. Right. And in, I know that in Europe, I mean, a lot of those groups are also connected to the, to the jugs. I mean, they have like very close relationship with yeah. the local jugs, for example. Uh, and they do. Uh, and uh, for instance, in France, they started uh, with hardly any women going to the Paris jug. And then uh, they found out, uh, found a Dutchess there. And they s decided to go f to dinner before going to their local jug. And then now, Half of the group running the Yav user group in Paris is female, and they orga help organize DevOps, uh, for yeah. DevOps France and DevOps Kids events everywhere. So yeah, they just needed the little push to organize themselves together and go and right to be more comfortable, yeah. basically attending like a lot of the um, uh, events that yeah. Guys and if, go and in to, fact, right? we had one uh, lady from the UK who lived in Manchester who was like, "Yeah, we don't have Dutch, but we don't have a jug either," and we were like. Hey, go start the job then, right? And she did. She started. She just uh, started a meetup group. Said, "I will be there with uh, cookies and tea, being British, of course." And she was like, "Okay, I will see who shows up." And there's like ten people showed up for the first meeting, and now it's been running for I think four years, maybe. Probably, yeah. Very nice. Yeah, that's a question to start, right? Yeah, that's yeah. a thing. Okay, so. Um, Anything else? So the, the, the URL, what is the URL again? Yeadoshes.org. Okay. It's, uh, so visit the website, yep. visit the website and uh, find out more. Right. Yes, yep. and look for like a local jog, I mean a Duchess uh, group and connect with them and go to conferences, start networking, right? Yep. And take all the advantages that guys have, basically, right? Yes. That's it. So thank you both. Thank you, Linda. Thank, thank you, you for Regina. having us. Yeah. Thank, thank you. you.